Eagle was founded in 1975 by Mel O'Reilly and his son Mike O'Reilly joined the business in the 90s and they've grown together this business to uh, the heights it is today. Both of them have built this, quite frankly, this really gem of a business um, that spans the whole spectrum of helicopter product and services. And what they've done in the last 48 years this year has been tremendous. We've recognized the opportunity to diversify into new platforms. Our um, completions have ranged now to Airbus and reconfigurations in the Sikorsky as well as the Leonardo platforms. So we've, we've really branched out in that area, uh, acquiring assets, providing either whole helicopters and or parts and components. So very different sort of approaches uh, to very different models, uh, one on a, on a segment that is completely, you know, almost fallen off the face of the earth, while the other one is, uh, is constantly growing. Eagle has recently uh, purchased a significant amount of inventory for the aircraft that are on fleet. We have invested millions of dollars to ensure that we have parts available. Our newest business line, Eagle Copters Parts and Component Solutions, EPCS, is a part out division that has purchased assets and uh, done the complete part out for aircraft to support these aircraft that are now operating worldwide. Not only have they built an organization with some tremendous value and product offerings, but the culture and the overall um, fabric and eagle that is focused on customer service as well as focused on our people is something that is very, very unique. And in terms of what customers really want, they want to have an economical solution that gets them up in the air where their AOG is limited to just a change out of a part or a component. And they want to work with a company like Eagle that is easy to work with. Uh, you put all that together, uh, I think it's a matter of time before Eagle spreads our wings uh, even further than we are today uh, across all of our offerings. Um, we've got quite a few plans in the works today, uh, but that, you know, you're just going to have to wait and see how that all unfolds.